Last thing I want to talk about is uh, drainage bag or JP ball. Which way do you go with cold cystostomy tubes? To gravity every time. Hmm. Interesting. You do JP ball? Yeah. And I'll tell you why. Because that okay. bile is super thick and infected and I want to get it out. I want, I want, there needs to be some vacuum to pull all that infected fluid out. If it's just to a drainage bag, I feel like it's more likely to clog. The, 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 the drain itself is more likely to get clogged. That's my take on it. Now, I, would, I don't have I would the science love, behind it, but. Right. I would love to get the Twitter IR's opinion on this. I just assumed yeah. everyone was doing what I was doing. I, I never gave it a second thought. Like when you put that on the outline, like JP versus gravity, I'm like, yeah. I was like, oh, is this a straw man? Everyone does gravity. <laughs> but what is the. Yeah. But like, that's the thing is a text would always hand me the drainage bag. I'm like, no, give me a bulb. Because to me, it's just like any other infected space. I mean, other than like neft tubes. But there's a lot more pressure with the kidney pushing urine out through the tube. The gallbladder doesn't have that same kind of pressure, right? It's occluded. So you got to have something that's going to pull that fluid out. Otherwise, all that sediment and, and stuff it's that, 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 that the, the pigtail sitting in is going to lead to it getting clogged. And that, that's my whole, now it's just, I don't have any science behind it, but I just feel like it's more likely to get clogged if you just, if you don't have pressure pulling it out. I don't think my cholecystostomy tubes are getting clogged very often. Uh, okay. I think, I think like standard drain care, like, you know, we still flush it BID or, you know, yeah. I don't flush it, but nurse, the nurses are flushing it. You put BID. orders in to flush it BID. Oh yeah. 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 Uh, like I just, I, I think I have five like a, CCs. I think it says five to 10 CCs. Like it's now like kind of an epic order set where like I just, it's a, actually a dot phrase for a nursing communication. Um, yeah. but, um, my thought was always that, you know, you don't need to pull it out because the gallbladder is contracting. And so it's just going to go the path of least resistance. And if the cystic duct is clogged, then it's going to push it out into this big open tube. Um, and also like when, so I, I wouldn't have a problem doing a JP bowl, but when they go home, like say they fully recover, you know, it's the ICU cholecystostomy case that like, you know, fully recovers and is going home, but they're going home with a tube in. Um, are you still going to have it to a JP bowl? Yeah, a JP bulb you can put in your pocket, whereas the bag is like, it's a whole, di you know, like, where do you put the bag? It can't fit in their pants. It's mm -hmm. got to sit on the exterior. So I, I feel like the patient appreciates the JP bulb more as well. That might be true. Um, I always thought that, or my line of thinking was that, you know, at some point, you know, it's very possible that the, the cystic duct opens up or whatever they had going on in the ICU has kind of uh, relaxed and and some, like, you know, like sometimes you do Coley checks. I mean, that's the whole point of doing the Coley check is like you put the dye in, then you have all of a sudden you have a patent cystic duct. And so having like a gravity bag allows that uh, bile to have like a choice, like, hey, I can still go in the bag. But, you know, if the cystic duct is open, like I'm going to yeah. I'm going to flow the anatomical route. And in yeah. fact, in, in uh, med school, like this kind of stuck with me, but I, I didn't do it in residency or a uh, fellowship. The IR doc would have the patient's uh, wear their gravity bag high, like on their shoulder. And the idea was that like the path of least resistance, um, he wanted to push it more towards the cystic duct. Oh, okay. Huh. That's interesting. Yeah. Cause then that way pressure like, is building up to, to, to clear it out. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Maybe there's a paper out there about this. I've, I have yet to see it, but if anybody in the audience, uh, knows of any science behind this, like, it's like a myth buster. Um, maybe we could, we could I, solve I, it. I suspect it's one of these things that all roads kind of lead to the same place. Um, right. That right. my cholecystostomy tube checks aren't having like any higher <laughs> degrees of patency with the cystic duct than yours are. Yeah. Um, I think like if I had to guess, my, my gut says that uh, either either one will work well.